Well, good afternoon, everybody. Shevaholic is still alive. <laughs> what do I got going on? Well, rebuilding transmissions like crazy. We got ourselves a Ford Flathead, 1937. 55 Chevy panel. Lots of work to do on that one. Carburetors. Rebuilding carburetors like crazy. Seems like everyone's plow truck is plugged up. We got 1930 Chevy over here, all original. Got a lot of work on that one. And I got this 27 Ford Model T with a uh, 322 Buick nail head. And it had the Dynaflow transmission and torque tuber end. Transmission's junk. So we're upgrading that to modern Turbo 350 and a modern rear axle. That's the project I'm doing right now. Got my adapter in from Benson's. Nicely made. So that's what I got going on. Non-stop work, work, work. Plus my day job. But here's a quick little video to prove that, yeah, I'm still here. Still kicking. Still working. I know I need to get more videos up. People yell at me all the time for that. It's just finding the time. So I'll make this short and sweet because I want to keep working on this car. <laughs> because it's already 3 o'clock in the afternoon and I was hoping to be further than this. I got to make some funky headers for this. I got to move the engine forward a couple inches because the steering box is right there. And to clear that adapter and to clear my Turbo 350. It'll be tight. But I got plenty of room to move it forward. So that's not a problem. Rear axle, I don't know what he's going to use. Hopefully he coughs it up here pretty quick. He did bring over an S10 one, but then he was talking about something of a Firebird or Camaro. So, But I'm going to need that pretty soon. Because I got to mock up all the way brackets and I make some ladder bars to hold everything. And then I'll be on to this one. Kind of excited to work on that one. All original. 1930 Chevy. 194 six cylinder. Supposedly it runs. We'll find out. Alright. I gotta get crack a lacking, guys. Later.